this was a great huge huge way to end this road trip obviously you walked into an absolute buzzsaw against edmonton Connor mcdavid went out there and had a great game then you're going on the road to the best team in the nhl in vancouver that's going to be a tough game to win you lose there then you get a you get a layup Calgary has been playing like shit the past couple games. They just came off a bad loss. You go in there, you beat them up. Reimer with a huge shutout was standing on his head. Kaner got in there, got a couple points. Raymond got a couple points. But the guy I said when I, I made the tweet at the end of the Calgary game, my heroes for this game were Ben Sherratt and James Reimer. Obviously, Reimer with the shutout, 38 saves, 30 or er, 38 shots, 38 saves. That's huge. But Ben Sherratt played a great game against Calgary. Oh, it was sure. probably the best game I've seen him play so far this year because we know what he can do when he's playing. He's been around the league for a while, big physical defenseman. He can do some things, but he hasn't looked great this year for the Red Wings. That game was huge. That game was huge for him to come out there. Like I said, if this is your fifth D-man and he's playing like that, that is a very good sign. For the Red Wings, obviously, Petrie, Olimata, hate them. They need to go. Get out of here. But if Ben Sherrod's playing like this, he can be a good piece in your defensive rotation. And on top of that, you come in, Seattle, need the two points. Need the two points because Matthews and Toronto, they're on a heater. Obviously, it was great that New York got the win over um, over the Islanders, but they got a point out of that because it went to overtime. So you need the two points against Seattle, and you got it. Huge, huge win to end the road trip because it's not getting any easier. You're going back home, and the first game you got is Nathan McKinnon, Kale McCarr, and the Colorado, Colorado Avalanche coming in. <laughs> the Colorado <laughs> Avalanche <laughs> coming <laughs> into <laughs> LCA. So that's not going to be a walk in the park. That is, Those are two of the top seven players in the NHL that you're going to have to look against. But this was huge. Great two points. And now I think this means... I think they're going to do it. I think they're going to make a trade. Whether it's Chikrin, I think they need to get some blue line depth. Get a guy that can be solidify, solidify your top four D-men in the trade deadline. Bring somebody in. Make a push. 